Hi everybody. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to install the Android system, uh, a mobile system over your uh, HTC HD2. As you see here, here's the HTC HD2. It actually comes with a Windows 6.5. And uh, here's a, actually there's a customer installed. I'm going to show you step by step how to uh, unlock the security, upgrade your radio and uh, install the custom ROM and finally install the Android over your phone. Uh, just to, to know here that we uh, you have uh, w once the Android is running the Windows is not running and if the Windows is running the Android is not running so simply no no system is running in the shadow of the other one it's only one system booting uh, uh, at any given moment okay so first of all then I have to uh, to go to the uh, the so-called boot bootloader mode. Here we go. Now close the uh, mobile. Okay. Simply uh, by d by doing this, you have to uh, to press the uh, volume button uh, with along with the uh, power button. Here we go. Let's do it. Okay, just a moment. Okay. So you just take your finger from the uh, from the power first before leaving it from the uh, volume. All right. Now, as we see here, it's, it says uh, serial. Once you uh, attach your USB connection, it's going to be USB. All right. Let's just do it. Wait. Okay. And just a second. Right. Okay. Now it changed to USB. So now we are ready. So what's gonna what's, what we're what going to do right now is uh, first of all we have to unlock the security over the over the phone. Okay, just a moment. Here we go. It's quite, okay. So this is done by what's called the uh, HSP L3. It's a utility that allows you to unlock and unlock your phone. So simply, if you do, if you want to return it back to the uh, to the uh, customer care ser services for any. Uh, uh, hardware uh, errors or stuff, you can simply return it back without violation of your uh, uh, guarantee stuff. Okay, and so in order not to violate your warranty, you have to uh, to un to, un to look your phone again. Here we're going to show you how to unlock it. We just press next, checking the connection. Okay. Uh, once it's uh, unlocked, it's going to write on your phone the HSPL. And uh, okay, here it says, here it says that installed SPL version. This means your uh, your mobile is, your mobile is still locked. You'll have to choose here the HSPL, the hard uh, reset. Okay, next. And now it's, it's going to start hacking your uh, device. Uh, so again, as I told you, if you want to um, return your device for any certain reason and you don't, you don't want to uh, violate the uh, uh, the conditions, uh, so your warranty still is it still valid. You simply uh, choose the other option, and it's going to return it back to its uh, original setting. Okay, here we go. It says here we we have hacked it. Okay, yes, it says yes. That's right. Okay. So okay, now you have to to once the screen is turned off, you press on the volume button so it it boosts directly into the bootloader instead of Windows. Okay, now before we, we install a custom ROM, we have we have to erase any trace for the uh, for the previous ROM, which is simply done by another tool called the Task Twenty Nine. Okay, the same so again. It's so simple. It's not it's not, it's not magic. You you simply press next 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 and everything is done. Okay, here we go. Next, yes, I have completed. Next. Okay, update. Next. Next, uh, this one is gonna go fast because it's just erasing. So it's the same, the same uh, way of installing your ROM instead of just erasing. Okay, here we go. So again, you'll just press the down the down volume button in order to boot into the uh, the bootloader again. Once it, once it's done. Okay, here we go. All right. So now we've unlocked the device. We have erased the uh, the previous ROM. Okay. 
from the internal memory. Now the device is simply blank. Okay. Uh, now we're gonna install the radio. This was this, this radio. I believe it's the latest one up to now. It's uh, 15.40.15. All this stuff. Okay. Uh, the links for all this stuff I'm doing right now are simply uh, 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 attached with the with the video. So you, you so you can actually download them. All right. So again, run as admin. Yes. Okay. I understand. Next. Next. Okay, this should install the latest radio. I believe the radio has to do something with your wireless connections. Uh, it's going to enhance it. So it's better to install it and it actually makes the Android run faster. Okay. And also, I believe it has to do something with the battery use, maybe. Uh, anyway, you have to upgrade to the latest version, which is the. Uh, 15.40 point, point something okay. so now every time you uh, finish uh, this installation you just have to press the down volume button and it's uh, gonna boot directly into the bootloader Now here comes the, uh, the last step, <coughs> which is installing the ROM, the desired ROM you want. The, uh, up to now, we're doing stuff related to Windows. We haven't yet approached the Android. Okay, so we'll choose. There are actually plenty of ROMs here. I'm gonna choose this one because I like it. It's, okay, here it says the custom RUU is actually update utility, ROM update utility. So we'll just run as admin. Okay, of course, if you are using Windows Vista or uh, Windows 7, you have to run everything as admin. Other, uh, other than this, it won't run. So again, the same procedure. Run uh, next, 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 next. Okay, update. Next, next. Okay, by finishing this step, you'll simply have your mobile with the uh, with a custom ROM and with no security. So we'll be ready to install the Android. The Android itself is pretty uh, simple because it's the, the ROM uh, is already rooted and by rooted means it's unlocked. So you will just uh, move the folder into your SD card and uh, start it. That's it. It's it's not difficult and so simple. So once we finish this one, I'm going to show you how to uh, how to do it. Okay, here we here simply we won't put uh, back to the bootloader because we want to put into Windows because I want to show you how to do it. Okay. <clears throat> okay. So now we're done with this one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just so now, uh, this ROM is actually this is a custom ROM called the VBN. Uh, it's, okay. Uh, so here, it's, here are the information about your uh, device. Okay. Okay. Now we're gonna. Uh, okay. As you see here on the screen, I've got plenty of ROMs for the Android. Uh, I prefer, I actually prefer the Chinese Android builds because they are really pretty fast on the uh, on my device. Mm -hmm. uh, but there are actually other uh, other ROMs available. I mean, there are over hundred ro uh, custom ROMs for the Android for the HTC HD two. So uh, you simply every time you want, you just go check uh, an, awesome, an awesome site called the XDA Developers. Okay, here's actually, and it's uh, an amazing site. It's just gonna. Uh, show you the updates about the, uh, the ROMs and all these stuff. Okay, now I'm gonna show you which let's choose which ROM here. Let's just use okay, let's just use the JDMS 1.62. Okay, this is a good one. 
uh, it's a good ROM because it um, allows support for right left uh, languages like Arabic. Okay, or uh, so what basically we're going to do is wait a second. Okay, we have first one. 